So we haven't locked down what our exact plans are, but you know, rest assured, we're going to make every effort to make it very difficult, if not virtually impossible, to steal from you, the mod maker, so that you have ownership over your work, and only you have ownership over your work. I was wondering to what extent the UI can be customized in the editor that would show up in game. I think you've done some work on this, Mike. Can you can you speak to this? What's what's possible? There's a there's quite a bit of customization you can do. Uh, as you saw in the the little first person over the shoulder uh, video we showed a minute ago, you can make your own custom buttons on the screen. You can make entire dialogues. Uh, you can put images inside of those dialogues, text, color, you can, basically we, we created a bunch of tools for things that we aren't planning to use in the campaign. We asked for a lot of things that, you know, programmers groan over a little bit because we say, well, we don't need this, but imagine what the modders could do. So we really try and give you as much uh, UI customization as we can. And that's sort of a core question. Every time a feature comes up in the game, like we want a boss bar, we want anything you can imagine. The one thing Mike always asks, or Matt always asks, well, how can we make this as flexible as possible so that mod makers can really make use of it? One of the things we've added for our game is an inventory system. Well, you've seen our game and you've played it on the floor. We don't need an inventory system for StarCraft II. It's not part of our core gameplay mechanics, but it's something we know that you, the mod users, will use. So we've been doing a lot of work, and the engineers have been very supportive of this, of trying to get these kinds of systems, in, systems into the game so you guys can really make use of them. In what ways will the hero system in Galaxy be more flexible than it was in World Warcraft 3? So the question, what ways will the hero system be more flexible? Yeah. So you'll be able to recreate anything you wanted to do with Warcraft 3 in the hero system. But I think you can also create any number of other heroes. Our data editor is extremely powerful. Everything you saw in the Uberlisk was all created in the data editor. All, our entire game is created in the data editor. Everything is coded with the data editor. So there's nothing in our game that you could not recreate. If you wanted to recreate, oh, I don't know, maybe a little game called Brood War in our game, you could absolutely do that. I was a very big fan of doing missions, and uh, I never really had any incentive to do secondary missions. So what are you going to add to make those more useful? I'm sorry, I don't think I understand the question. Could you elaborate for us a little bit? Well, in Warcraft 3, you had your primary objectives, uh -huh. then you had secondary things. Right. But in StarCraft, you didn't really need the secondary things because your heroes couldn't do anything. Yeah. So what are you going to do to make those secondary things more important? Right, so in StarCraft 2, right, like we've got sort of main objectives and bonus objectives, which speaks to sort of the same things you're talking about. And we also have an achievement system, right, for, for our game at least, which we can use to encourage you to stretch and try to use your bonus objectives and try to make them a little bit more part of the experience for you. We've also got the option, of course, to offer you more money or additional research or lots of bonuses that will affect the next missions that you play based on the bonus objectives you, 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 you know you complete. As a mod maker, of course, you can do whatever you want with bonus objectives, offer all kinds of benefits to players. You know, depending on what your mission is about, you can really offer them whatever you want and hopefully do some really cool stuff. Hi, um, my question is, uh, in the map editor, will it be possible to adjust armor to work the way it does in Warcraft 3 as a percentage rather than as a static value? Yes. We actually added that specifically to support being able to reproduce the, the combat systems of past games. So we have a lot of little fields like that that we've just basically turned 